Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about solving quadratic equations by factoring. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here, 3x squared minus 8x equals 16, and we need to solve this by factoring. I'm going to bring the 16 over to the left hand side. So we have 3x squared minus 8x, and if I subtract a 16, I have a minus 16 here on the left equals um, 0 on the right. I now have a quadratic equal to 0. Let's factor it. My a value is 3. What two numbers multiplied by 3? Well, that's 1 and the 3. I look at my c value being 16, and let's go list the numbers that multiply, or it's negative 16. But let's find the list of numbers that multiply to be a positive 16. That's 1 and 16, 2 and 8, and, well, 4 and 4. So now, since it's a negative 16, and our b value is negative, one of these numbers in a pair has to be negative. So we have to ask ourselves, 3 times which one plus the other one equals negative 8, and then being negative. And that's actually the 4s here, okay? The 4s is what we're going to deal with. One of them will be negative. 3 times a negative 4 is a negative 12, plus 4 is a negative 8. So let's see that. 3 times a negative 4 equals a negative 12. And then, well, 1 times the other 4 really is what happens. 1 times 4 equals a positive 4. Add them together, and we get a negative 8. So our two numbers are 4 and negative 4. All right, so let's go break this down. In factored form, it's 3x here, and then a 1x equals 0. And remember, we said 3 gets multiplied by the negative 4. So the negative 4 has to be on this parenthesis, and then the positive 4 in this one. Now we have it factored. We can set each part individually equal to 0. 3x plus 4 equals 0, and x minus 4 equals 0. And let's solve. Subtract a 4 to both sides, and 3x equals a negative 4. Divide both sides by 3, and x equals a negative 4 thirds. Add a 4 to both sides. The second equation, not too bad, x equals a positive 4. So we can write these two answers as a single statement as x equals a negative 4 thirds and 4, and that is our final answer. I hope this video is helpful for you, and if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, Thanks for watching. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math.